I bought this uh, paper collection quite some time ago now. It's a Polish brand called Piątek 13 Friday the 13th and a lovely beautiful paper set designed by Marta Pikarczyk, uh, my friend. She uh, is really talented as you will see now if you've never seen her papers, her work. She is unreal and those papers are gorgeous, gorgeous papers. Uh, I wanted to create from those for so long but of course I got distracted, I was too busy but today it's the day that I will finally uh, get to create. Now uh, this is the back of the of the paper pad which is fabulous because uh, you can uh, fussy cut elements for your projects which is great use of the back really. Uh, so I'm looking now for some sort of uh, paper that I will be using as my main. Everything is so pretty that it's a waste and a shame to cut it <laughs> nearly. Uh, so I'm looking for, oh look, even the front now, the, the cover is like a paper as well. So it's a nice recycling way that the cover, you can use the cover as well but the back is a paper. Fantastic idea. Uh, so which paper will I use? Maybe I will try and use this one. I'm going to cut that in smaller and get back to you. All the uh, beautiful flowers are fussy cut and I have my background ready as well. Now I'm thinking maybe I will add a little bit of interest uh, to my card and I was thinking to cut my paper. Now I'm trying to uh, make some interest because the card as it is, look at that, it's already very gorgeous, really really beautiful and you don't need much now uh, and I'm, I'm, my plan is to maybe add a little bit of congratulations and it's gorgeous but I was thinking to make some interest at least to try and I'll show you what I was thinking. I was thinking to cut that smaller and to and to add some lace basically, a little bit of a lace as the as the interest to my card. So this is it and then I'm thinking to make this either smaller, let me grab the lace, there we go. So either uh, to add my lace like this, okay, and it's gorgeous or something else. I'm not too sure but I I am basically trying, trying, trying. Oh lovely. Now this is gorgeous. This is super gorgeous and let's play around with those paper embellishments. So now from the very plain looking in a way and simple card we are making a little bit of interest and it's less simple, less but well, it's equally pretty. <laughs> and the congratulations could go here uh, or, voila, wow, because actually the direction of those flowers, oh, Hannah just woke up, <laughs> I'll show you her. Hello. Hi. Hi. Are you there? Did you have a good sleepy? Are you coming to me? Are you coming to mama? Are you coming to mama? <laughs> I can see her through my uh, bookshelf. I better get her. Are you coming? <laughs> can you see me? <laughs> Good morning, princess. <laughs> Are you gonna play there on your own and let mommy finish the card? Will you? Will you? Have fun, Missy. <laughs> I'll be right back to you, okay? Uh, I left her there because, uh, you know, if she called me, if she calls me pretty intense, then I'll go. But I think she's happy out for a little while on the couch after a nap. Now, look, instead of having the card as usual, as always, is it vertical or uh, the other vertical? I'm gonna Google that. Uh, yes, it's called horizontal, vertical and horizontal, <laughs> I checked it. So I'm thinking to turn this around because the flowers di uh, direction, it's not that obvious and it's, it can be easily used like that. And look, 
voila so let's glue that down uh, and let's uh, finish this simple card a really five minute card I would say easily five minute card without chatting and showing and stuff uh, okay fussy cutting is taking a little bit longer and uh, this is the only thing uh, that is taking a little longer is the fussy cutting rather than other than that uh, it's really simple card if you're buying your papers now it's lovely to have a look at the background papers as well as the embellishments on the papers that are usually painted print uh, painted um, what I love about those papers, those are hand painted by Marta, so it's really, really nice, and you have the feeling of handmade, and it's gorgeous. I love that idea. I've done uh, papers a little different. I've done only embellishments, really, on my Etsy store. You can have a look. Uh, you could use them as well for cards, of course, but this is what I love about those papers. Now, this will be tricky <laughs> a little bit to make those two. Oh, Hannah is uh, literally... Uh, climbing on the shelf <laughs> she is crawling she is already uh, standing upwards uh, in her cot it's it's unreal how time is flying how baby is changing it within hours nearly so it's gorgeous it's all amazing it's lovely it's wonderful to w witness it but it's so extremely sad to to actually see how fast time goes so I don't like that <laughs> now let's see just approximately uh, how we're gonna uh, stick our I'm gonna cut away this lace a little bit Hannah yeah she woke up as 90% in a good mood um, she I came downstairs with her it's Sunday morning actually everyone is asleep I came downstairs so I thought I'll start doing something and I just fed her and she fell asleep so I left her on the couch <laughs> Are you here? I can see you. <laughs> she's seeing, she's seeing me through that uh, shelf, so she can see me creating. Now she sees my hands and my desk. Okay, so I came downstairs, but I was thinking that I am not gonna create. No, but then when she fall asleep, I said, "Will I do breakfast for the family, or will I wait for them to wake up? We do it together." And I sneak in for a studio cre for a, a quick video of course sneak in for a quick video oh, hello especially when the baby is asleep you just quickly do it and i figured i'm going to show something new some like new brand that i enjoy now uh you you know i love showing you things new brands new ideas sometimes quick videos so yeah that would be nice I think that will be very nice for you to see now I'm sure that this brand if you look <laughs> hello hello if you look closely I'm sure you will be able to find it in your local store on the local store oh what did you find there Hannah or if not you can always ask your local stores for uh, trying to bring out um, brands from different countries so I know that uh, in Ireland you can get it in a few shops, so uh, some shops do ship to oh, hot, 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 to UK. So yeah, you can have a look at definitely. Um, I like to show you small brands that maybe are not known, and but the talent is there, and it's nice to recognize it. So I think it's just nice. Hannah, you better leave that remote control alone. She has the big fascination, like all the other kids as well, of course they do. Fascination for remote con remote control. You know what, I'm gonna try one more thing. Mm, I have this left over from this chipboard, uh, so I may use that. Hello! Do you want me to bring you to the studio? And I was thinking, how about this? You know what, no. I think it's a little too, too much, I don't know. I, no, you know what? I love how actually now this at least told me this made this white breakage in those in those dots and no, we leave it. We leave it, Marta. It's perfect as it is. What are you playing now? <laughs> you know what? I feel that my freedom is definitely over now. <laughs> that's how I feel. Uh, so yes, that's how I feel. No more freedom. We have to put everything up high because she's starting to climb everywhere now everywhere I mean everywhere and Henio oh poor animal she is c going to the cage and she is like sorry <laughs> like this 
so we have to mind the poor pet, pet because she would she would oh, I should actually look like that because she would she loves being around Henio crazy <laughs> and she is just where's Henio where's Henio she's so excited about Henio crazy excited this is the best thing ever that could happen to her having Henio around <laughs> I'm gonna maybe hide this under there. There we go. And now I will add some 3D foam. Are you okay? Oh yes, yeah, she, she just fall, fell, but she's climbing back on. No stopping for her now. I mean, seriously, no. St <laughs> I'll, I'm gonna show you her again because it's. I think it's very funny and since you are seeing her journey of I should take pick peel off the paper but that's okay since you are seeing her growing up journey from day one nearly I'll show you her oh that's so gorgeous now and look how simple is that card you would say too simple no simple is good simple classic is good no 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 you can't do that no no nie wolno Nie wolno, no. Yeah, I think the first word, no, I mean it. You don't touch that, no, no, Hannah. I think the first word she will understand is you can't. No, you can't. No, you can't. No, you can't. That's gonna be the first thing she she will understand. But she does understand when we say, where's Henio? She turns head to Henio, so she does get the idea. Oh, that's so gorgeous. Now, the last finishing touches would be um, our liquid pearls. I don't know which color. I, I'm going to go for probably the transparent one because we have some dots. Do I want more dots going around? No, I don't think so. But do I? would I like some interest? Most definitely. Yes. So I'm going to actually put my dots where the dots are, the actual dots of the black dots so this will dry nicely transparent and it will be gorgeous I hope anyway you know what wouldn't that be just so cute to have it all transparent that's what I'm gonna do for a change all the dots are gonna be transparent now there we go the noise that she makes is the excitement. She is up for something. She's, uh, yeah, she's. She grabbed the. She grabbed some. The remote control, I think. I can. S I see you, Hannah. No, no, no. Don't think I don't. I do see you, Honey Ben. Hannah Banana. A little time consuming those dots but I think it's gonna be a gorgeous effect and again think outside of the box how else you can actually improvise with simple things so that's my advice for today think out of the box turn around have a look wait a little while think for what else could be done changed if you have a paper cut it in half see what happens if you have vertical do it the, the the other way the horizontal way you know think outside the box I'm thinking to actually uh, leave that part without uh, dots uh, without transparent dots I should come back to you when this is dry and finished because now it's blue so you barely can see anything uh, I, you, we can't see whether it's pretty or not so I'm gonna come back to you, I'm gonna feed Hannah and I maybe come back to you in just a few minutes to see how long uh, this will dry and see how this will be. I love that. Super pretty. I'm missing that maybe some white splashes. Yes, I'm gonna add some white splashes. I think this will be uh, nice. Just a touch of white on my flowers. Mm-hmm. A little more, maybe. So this kind of unifying everything together it just looks nice, I think. There we go. Voila! <laughs> I actually forgot I had another plan for this card. I wanted to add same kind of green flower that I have from Ag from Agnieszka from my friend. I bought them. I showed you them in the previous video. Uh, she makes them and I bought a few. 
of them of her because she makes them and they are so gorgeous and I thought that this will actually like this is pretty this is very pretty but I think this is much prettier I think yes definitely I think this is just finishing off uh, the card nicely it joins those greens as well somewhere like that I was thinking isn't it it's still not very tr not very 3d uh, I need more glue but it is a little bit 3d a little bit 3d now Hannah just jumped back on the couch and she's playing <laughs> as you can hear <clears throat> her, with her things so no something like this ah that's nice that is nice and um, I also have those tiny flowers that I think could match nicely somewhere there they were also in the pack well in a where will I add them maybe there oh nice So they are delicate, nice greeny as well, greeny, whitey, maybe there, I think so, could be nice. Let's see if we can stick them somewhere there. Of course you should, oh, are you okay? <laughs> are you okay? <laughs> of course you should be adding uh, those flowers. Uh, before you add the liquid liquid dish pearls because it's harder to work now and you are uh, Hannah is fine don't worry <laughs> and you are uh, you can just get you can just destroy your your little dots so we just have to be very careful about that now or maybe something like this a little bit there we go I also wanted to add chipboards but, but you know what I'm gonna skip chipboards this time because I think it's gorgeous just the way as it is absolutely beautiful 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 <laughs> and here is my card dry all the little dots are dry I'm not too sure how you can see it through the camera it's really nice shiny dimensional in comparison to this part and it looks really interesting uh, to the eye and if you look like that uh, you can see how a 3d dimensional that is very texture nice in the touch in the feel actually I hope you enjoyed this simple card tutorial uh, I usually make cards like that so this way it's quite interesting and I should remember more often about this type of vertical or horizontal whichever is that uh, way of creating cards because I think uh, we forget to create that way uh, definitely I do forget <clears throat> I hope you uh, pick up some uh, tips from that it's really simple easy card for everyone grab some pretty papers a little bit of lace scissors bit of time and make some pretty simple card uh, I cannot wait to hear from you and if you enjoyed this video uh, it will be a pleasure if you could share that with your friends on your social media uh, it means so much to me uh, that others can see this card and many other projects so they can get inspired so I'm thanking you in advance for sharing that video subscribing to my channel for new videos to come and for for likes and comments and thumbs ups <laughs> thank you so much and I'll talk to you soon have a have a good day and fun have fun creating bye <laughs> bye bye